Innovation is at the very core of everything we do at Lockheed Martin. And as we look to the future, we know that staying at the leading edge requires a wide range of talent in our workforce. So for us, embracing diversity and inclusion isn't just the right thing to do, it's the smart thing to do. It creates an environment of collaboration where everyone can reach their full potential. That's what sparks the great ideas that drive innovation, and that's what will shape our future. In 2004, 20% of our workforce were women. To attract the best and brightest, we knew we had to institute a culture of change and Women Accelerating Tomorrow was born. Today, nearly one quarter of our workforce are women. Our employee leadership forums and employee resource groups are flourishing, and our chairman, president, and CEO has been recognized in major publications for her global leadership. My first experience at a Women's Leadership Forum was so invigorating. It was so empowering for me to network with other women in my industry and in other industries as well. A key part of Women Accelerating Tomorrow is helping to grow a pipeline of diverse STEM-skilled innovators. And we want to do this inside of our company and with our young people outside of the company to capture their imaginations and help them to know that a STEM career is possible for them. We partner with hundreds of STEM programs, and our employees volunteer more than 100,000 hours every year in STEM education outreach initiatives. Accountability is absolutely crucial to our success. Our leaders are expected to embrace diversity and inclusion, and to model that behavior leading by example. These behaviors are built into our LM Commit performance management process. We come from a highly technical workforce. One of the things that Women Accelerating Tomorrow really focused on was robust metrics and feedback. We were able to get that through instruments like our LM Voice Survey. It's a comprehensive employee survey, and with that feedback, we were able to benchmark across our industry. And as a result, from 2004 to 2012, we were able to increase representation of women in our leadership ranks from 17% to 22%. We know we have more work to do, and we're committed to doing it, to enable the women of Lockheed Martin to accelerate tomorrow and lead us into the future. <laughs>